Alright, welcome back guys. Last time we... What did we do? We did a... We did a lot, actually. We solved a lot of problems. I think we have to fix Leaky. Before we can do this. Because I'm not... And we can try and spell out all that stuff at the bottom, but... What you call it? I feel like... I feel like the water needs to be gone. It's like, how do you get rid of the water? You have the bucket, because you can see, like, there are roads. Like, we're supposed to be able to walk down to this, it looks like. So I think we need the bucket fixed. So the bucket can clear out the water. Which probably take them a little bit. And then that way we can get in there and do all the stuff and solve that little puzzle, but I don't know where the pebble is. Like, that's such a weird request that he wants a freaking pebble to, like, to plug the leak. And that's like, where are the, where are the pebbles? Actually, have we been here? Uh, probably have. So let's take one more good look around. I see, like, the Shark Island thing over there. I don't see any pebbles though. Like, I wish she gave us a hint. It said, oh, the pebbles. They're pebbles native to the next area or something. It's just, no. So, where have we not been? Oh! Up. There we go. Picked a horrible, horrible time to record. What it's looking like. Okay, so we can get down into the lighthouse it's looking like. I'm trying not to fall off of this. I'm trying to fall off this, but I'm not trying to like fall all the way off of this. Okay. Completely forgot about the lighthouse. We can just go down. Oh, we unlocked this now. And we got a token for doing it. I guess it was barred from the other side. Like a freaking Dark Souls door. So where's the pebble, though? Like, where would you hide a pebble on this map? That we have not been yet. Maybe down there? Definitely not over there. I think we've been in there. Like, it's a very short list of things we have not done. Actually, I don't see anything that we haven't done, really. Besides maybe going there. Take one of those guys. I don't know, I may have to come back to this. That's what it's looking like. So I don't see any pebbles over there. Especially up here, because we can look at everything. I don't see any there. Especially because it's like, it is a pebble. Pebbles are tiny. By nature, I don't know if you've ever seen a pebble. They are tiny things. They are tiny and very docile creatures. And we do not have one. Yes, let's come over here. I thought I can double jump at any point in time. I'm trying to like run quickly. Oh, you guys were really slow. Can I, like, trick him into blowing up or something? No? Okay. <laughs> Alright. There are no pebbles to be had. I see feathers. There's no, like, pebble in the bottom of the lake. Or whatever you want to call that thing. Oh, God! Look at that, and he's, like, between me and the shore. There's a honeycomb there, though. kind of left us alone, too. So I guess let's... I'm probably gonna take some damage. That's a asshole spot to hide one of those. Let's look around a little more. See anything? Alright, I'm gonna 
make a quick edit, cut, slice thing here. For you guys, it's going to be a couple seconds. For me, it's going to be probably a couple hours, because I'm just going to go. I picked a horrible time to record, so I need to do some stuff. But yeah, so I'll see you guys in a minute. Or a second. Two hours. Hmm. <laughs> Alright, we're cutting back and we're over here. I turned the game off for a little bit and had breakfast. I was doing some other stuff. And I accidentally found this. So I was trying to start back up at the uh, at the cavern. But I couldn't find it. It's so, like I was heading this way. It came in here. It came in here. And then I found the... What you call it? The uh, a cauldron. So that cauldron's doing stuff. I'm trying to get up here. I'm trying to get up here. No! I'm trying to see the stuff. Banjo, please. Is there anything up here? Oh, there is. Okay. That's good. I don't think this is the other shortcut that we had. I don't think this works. Yeah! There's nothing! Cool. So we need to find the frickin' frack cavern. I'm gonna give up on the pebble for a little bit. I don't need the jigsaw piece yet. I don't feel like running around World 2 anymore for a little bit. Oops. No oh, crap. Okay, so we don't. Oh, we do have enough. Well, we already saw where World 3. If you can call it World 3, we saw where that was. Third world. So down there was the. Okay, so that's where the ship was. This is where down here, I think that was where the little forest level was. We're not ready for that yet. We are ready for the cavern, which I should just look at my videos and see where the hell to go, but I don't. I'm assuming it's here. Perry's online, apparently. It's my main squeeze. Okay, this is here. Where's the fucking... Where... Where's the cavern? Seriously, about to boot up another one of the other videos just to look for it. Was it this way? Was it through the water? By the by the forest place? I don't think it was. I want to say that it was not, actually. I don't think it was in here either. I think this was a uh, specifically specifically the pirate world or the beach. Yeah. Well, there's also the... No! Okay, fine. I'm just gonna do this. Then there's this, and it's like, how do we use this? Long of tooth and strong of arm. Grunty's got the lasting charm. Okay. I see you, Grunty. No! I want to get in the cannon. How do I fire the cannon? Do I punch it? Do we use this? Do we drop on it? We hit that? No. We peck it. Like there's there isn't even fire in this thing. There's no fire in it to fire. I don't see any oh Okay. I don't see any uh flight or anything to use either. Camera, please. It's like, that's over there. Damn. Oh, can we just, like... Yeah. Was it this simple? Yeah, it probably was. Alright. So the cannon was not worthwhile. That is... Oh, shit. How did I lose so many feathers? I think it's because I turned the game off. I tried to leave it on for a bit, I left it on for an hour. And then I got caught up watching a stream and I said, you know, I'm not coming back for a bit, so let's just... Let's turn it off. But we got the piece, that's what we wanted. I can't fix the bucket. So I'm hoping... I mean, I probably can't fix the bucket, I have no idea where the pebble's at. Right, so I'm gonna aimlessly run around until I find the... The sewer place, I'm sure like eight people are screaming at their monitors right now. It's like, no, just go this way! It's back there! But, yeah. Oh, 
apparently I'm just blind as hell. So I'm pretty sure it's right in here. Okay. Alright. Right, that's it over there. How do we get through this without dying? That is the tricky part. We can't jump all the way up here, can we? No. We don't have the hops. We're not Air Jordan enough. Oh, what's here? Okay. Drain the water? Just give us a couple platforms? That's fine too. Some of the sharks can be in this water too. <laughs> it's like, I found you! I swam through the storm drain! Snacker's hungry! Oh... We misplayed horribly. We threw the game. Threw the game at Fire Giant. Yeah, I've been playing a lot of Smite. I mean, you guys can probably tell from me actually saying I've been playing a lot of Smite and then all my channel updates have Smite in it. So I guess we can hit this side too. Oh. So there are more secrets to uncover. I guess since this isn't really dangerous or anything, so I get back. Let's look around a little bit first. Check these platformerinos. Oh gosh. Let's see. <laughs> I guess Perry knows whenever I'm playing something obscure. Oh no! Oh no! Do you think I'm rather soft? Be waiting in the loft. Okay. Oh, what's up? Okay, you press X to talk. Fenty wears a flea circus under that repulsive dress of hers. That is pretty nasty. Like, what are we going to do with all these secrets, though? She's also got this nasty pet dog, whose name is... Big Naka. Okay. Sings in her own band. Grunty and the Broomstick Boys. They're awful. I don't know if that's... I think you're just being a hater at that point, because... I mean, maybe this is why Gruntilda has all these issues. Right? Because her sister just endlessly talks trash about her. You know, Matilda has these weird fashion choices, and her sister is sitting here just cutting her down, saying that's disgusting and repulsive, and why would anyone do that? Why am I related to you? I wish mom and dad didn't make me another sister. They're just all pissed off, and then it's like, Matilda's in her own band, she's doing stuff. And it's like, there, there's nothing to say about that. You know, why is she talking so much crap? Just the one new move, but it's hidden well. I mean, you could tell us. You could just... Oh, oh, I almost had the MLG skills. Actually, I think we have to go around. Probably jump on that thing, jump across. I hate water. I absolutely detest water in games. For one, it's rarely done well. Two, it's usually scary. When I played Super Mario 64, back in the day when I first got my 64, I had to have my... I actually had my dad be like the third level or whatever it was. With the, uh... Oh, shit! Got freaking jump scares! <laughs> I had my dad beat the third level for me, because it's like a water level and there's a shipwreck and there's a sea serpent in the ship and it was scary as hell. I can actually poke him. Oh, I can. Get out of here, you stupid slug thing. At least they die in one hit, too. That's actually really nice. There's a gold feather. I don't know what these do. Can you tell us? Lucky you. I'm an invulnerability feather. Bottles will tell you more. Okay. That's fine with me. I'm assuming Mumbo's in more places than... Ooh, than just the, uh... What you call it? The, uh, the first level. It'd be nice. I'm assuming he's going to be. Oh, that's right, because the transformation didn't even... Like, the transformation didn't go super far either. Like, we couldn't leave the level with it, really, so there's no point 
to Mumbo being restricted to one place. I see you, Jinjo. I got you, Jinbro. They are officially... That just happened right now. They are officially Jinbros. Because attaching bro as a suffix all of a sudden makes it funnier, especially when you make it a pun. This has been proven. It is the reason... I don't know. It's the reason good things happen in the world. I don't know how else to explain it to you guys. You just have to trust me. Yeah, I've been playing a lot of Smite. It's been a lot of fun. My friends... I'm gonna sound like a dick. I wish they were better. Oh, crap. Just because we play so many games where no matter like what role I'm playing... I'm not saying that I'm good. Or whatever, but like the people we're playing against, I'm good enough. And the people I'm playing with, I'm doing well with. And so, the reason... Is there anything else in here? Oh, we gotta... Okay. I don't think we need the... By the way, Banjo's so lazy. Because Kazooie does the strong flapping or whatever. I guess it's because she has stronger arms, technically. Oh, that looks like a giant fucking shark. I'm Clanker. Which is garbage grinder? Clanker not like dirty water. Want fresh air. Okay. Just don't hurt me, shark bro. You're big and scary. This is exactly why I hate water levels. Because they... Because... Okay, this is why. For one, it's usually hard to see stuff. In this case, this one isn't, thankfully. Two, it's always just spooky as hell. Three, they always put big shit in the water. And then, like, four... Oh, that should not hit me. And then, for number four, it's like... Do I have to double jump out of here? And then... Oh, gosh. Controls, please. That's, uh... I'm gonna blame... I don't even need the eggs. What the hell am I doing? I just want... By the way, I saw that he was chained down there, so I'm hoping that... You know what? I don't need the... I don't need that either. I just don't. But then, like, the fourth reason is... It's usually really hard to move in water. And since it's so hard to move in water, it's easier for you to get killed by the stupid big stuff. That's, like, really scary. So it's like... You feel really helpless, you can't do much about it, and it's always scary. So, I don't like it. I see stuff on here, but Clanker so far seems like a bro. I'm assuming he... it looks like... maybe you free him, and then you get like the fresh water. That's interesting. Is that like... rust or something? I know it's like not rust looking, that giant red spot or whatever. I don't know what that is, but... Is he like a humanoid? Not humanoid, but is he like an actual mammal? That has. Okay, I gotta be really careful here. Okay, let's take a step up. Get all the health. All of the health items. I like that they stay on screen the entire time, too. That's perfect. It's so helpful. Yeah, it looks like you either fly through here or you free him or something and you can jump and do all this stuff. Or maybe you, like, jump off his tail to get to those things and then. The only reason I'm saying is because there's stuff in the air, like those notes. It's so, like if he gets unchained, like Django, and then, oh, just for one note, then maybe you can get all those other notes up there. Okay, I see that we have to make jumps. Platforming. Oh, I almost missed that one. There are more things, too. There's more to explore. I'm trying to, like, be quick about this, too, like I'm a pro. Get these extra lives that I feel are actually worthless. Oh, if he... Dude, if he, like, falls out of there... He's donezo. Oh, I forgot to trigger! I got him that time, though. Like, it jumped... I think I pressed X back. Not by accident. It was definitely by choice, but it was the wrong choice. Okay, so Clanker's looking like a bro. He's not trying to hurt us. He's not trying to, like, chomp chompy, gobble gobble us. Okay, so I guess I have to go to that side with the shock jump. Oh, you can probably swim into him, I'm assuming, right? He's got a little blowhole. But yeah, I'm wondering if he's, like, an actual... He's obviously sentient if he's mechanical. He's covered in plating, but then, like, what's this red stuff? Does he have skin? Is he rusting? Is he sickly? Which would suck, because he's, you know, trapped and stuff. 
I can't get up here at all. So how the hell... Does he like... Okay. Like, the room looks perfectly outlined. Like, if he comes up, I can run across him, then jump over to this. So what's the key first? I'm congested as hell. Okay, what? I see shadows. Why are there shadows? Is there stuff? Like, I can jump in there. Is there stuff in there? Huh. Okay, we have to make a choice. We can swim through here. Oops. We can swim down there. This may have been where I stopped playing as a kid. I thought it was the beach level. I don't remember this level. But with my fear of water in the 90s or whatever, I could definitely see myself stopping here. I see I see a path there, I see another path, I see a third path. The two green ones right here probably go together. There are eggs under him. We came on the front one. Like, I don't know how you free him. I see gold feathers down there and I don't know why. So let's just make a choice. Do I even have a tax in the water? Like what do I have access to? I mean, you could have just, like, floated out of here or something, dude. For some reason, you didn't. Okay. Time to edit this. It doesn't sound that loud. But then, like I said, once I get into editing, it's always like, Wing! Okay. I see you. Or I hear you, rather. I keep trying to turn with the right stick and it doesn't work. Well, let's just... There's almost no point to the ace swimming half the time. I'm starting to get these swim controls down though, thankfully. Okay. I mean, I guess we can go in the back and see what the rest of these are. The one I really don't want to do is I don't want to swim under him and then free him. We have to clean the water first too. He said he wanted that. Maybe if we clear or clean the water. And he'll be a bro and he won't, you know, swallow us. Just end our lives. I don't think I need to go this way. I'm going this way. Oh, why is this dark, man? Oh, it's nasty and green. Is this gonna hurt me? Okay. That was gonna be like poisonous water. Oh, shit! Snippet mutants are we! Jigsaw is ours. Fight us. You must. Oh shit. I don't know how, but they found me. Kazooie, it's up to you. Oh no. I'm sorry. That is not working. Okay. That was three. Is it just three of them? Four of them. Just roll into them. Oh! Gosh, that sucks. Like, rolling is good sometimes and then not good. Beaten snippet mutants are we. Hiss. Again, this is another, like, group of people or whatever, or like a, a boss thing where it's like, oh, you beat the shit out of me. Have a thing for it. Have a prize. Like, no. I guess you're supposed to use eggs, or eggs are a viable solution. Because they just they give you eggs, obviously. I really wish I could, like, turn the camera. That's like, I really, really wish I could turn the camera in here. I wish I had camera control. I have zero camera control. That actually is bothering me. Because, like, I don't... I guess this is shallow. I guess I have to jump on the pipe over here. And I'm having a lot of trouble doing that. I guess I have horrible depth perception. Okay. I almost fell off. Okay. Alright, so we're getting things. We're doing stuff. Apparently I'm out of... Am I out of jigsaw pieces entirely? No, I have 15. That's just one for the level, it looks like. Really? That's only one? I thought we had more. 
Okay. Yeah, playing Smite's been fun, it's just been crappy. Because, like, I'll have a lot of good games, but it's not enough for what we're doing. And it doesn't help that, like, our... Oh, I really need to go get those notes at some point. Probably do that next. But what doesn't help is that our team levels are really skewed, and our experience is really skewed. Like, a couple of us are 30. I'm almost 30. I'm 29. Oh, shit. And a couple of our friends are in the 20s, and a couple other people that aren't directly my friends, but we play with them, they're 30. And, you know, 30 is your account level. It's basically just showing your experience that you've played enough of the damn game. Okay, so we have plenty of time. Because we used almost five air bubbles, or whatever. I guess we're going here first, because I was closer to this. Yeah, like, a couple of the people we play with are very low level, aka very low experience. Myself and a couple friends that I play with have a lot of MOBA experience. We played, you know, other MOBAs, League of Legends, HOTS, no Dota, Guardians of Middle Earth, I played the shit out of that game. Probably only a couple people actually know me for that at this point. And a couple of people we play with have never played MOBAs. My friend Perry that I just messaged, he's never really put a lot of time into a MOBA. But Perry learns quickly. And he actually has a desire, so... You know, Perry does enough when we're playing, so that's good. But a lot of the other people we play with, that one of the other people that we play with invites, he's a person that used to be my friend, and now I'm not comfortable being his friend, but I still play with him because... It's weird, and I like playing video games, so I just kind of play with him because he has access to a lot of people. And it's more fun to play MOBAs when you have teams, even though sometimes your team sucks or you play with your friends. And no one rages at each other, thankfully. It's been pretty tame. But it's always helpful, so I guess we have to swim under him and free him now. Oh, don't. Okay. So I say, don't hit me with that tail blade, dude. This is like the last thing to do here, and I'm hoping it's not like spooky scary. It's looking spooky scary right now. It's looking very spooky scary right now. And I'm stuck. It is omega spooky scary down here. I know, I, I, I hear you, Jin bro. There's a... Oh, there's an air bubble fish. I don't know how this works. I don't know if you've ever tried to get air off of a bubble. Because most likely... This is carbon dioxide. Got my bubbles if you're low in here. Thanks, bubbles. This isn't Powerpuff Girls, but yeah. Like, I don't know how that started. Because a lot of the times when you see air bubbles underwater, at least from a humanoid or mammal source, it is, in fact, carbon dioxide. Okay. I, I need this, though. I, you don't know how bad I need this. Okay. Oh, you only get one off of that? That sucks. I was hoping for, like, a full, dude. Oh, it popped! I have so much trouble doing this right now. Okay. I think we're good for a little bit. So what's the point of this? How do I free him? Can I even attack down here? I need all the music notes. We need a key. Oh, there's a key here. How do we turn the key? Okay, we need bubbles. It's not too bad to get the bubbles, it's just really hard to control swimming still. Even though we're getting better at it. Oh, I can't see. Camera, please. Oh, 
Oh, I missed that one. Oh, I'm gonna die just trying to get bubbles, dude. Oh, this is dumb. Okay, so we have to swim through that to turn it. I don't know where the fish is. Like, I need to get behind him so I can chase him and get the bubbles. I can't, like, get one and then rotate. Okay. Alright, we're doing pretty good. Let me... Please? Say please, excuse me. Okay, so how do we... Okay. We're full on air. So we're doing okay. But how do we turn... How do we turn the key? It's have to, like, X through this? Okay. Had to get enough turns on it, I guess. It's got a gold tooth. <laughs> Clanker has fresh air. Oh, he said he wanted fresh air, not water. Okay. So we need to get these notes, because I don't want to come back here. I never want to be back here again. I'm pretty sure... Yeah, I can use... Okay. Are we going to go for it? I think we're going to go for it. Just go straight up. Don't do any crazy stuff, just go straight up, please. Alright, we got it. Ooh. Oh, I hate water. You have no idea how much I hate water. I mean, I love drinking water. Yes, he said fresh air, not fresh water. But I hate, 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 hate. Like, player haters level. Hate water. In games. Because it's rarely well executed. It wasn't too bad there, even though I was having some, some camera difficulties, but I forgot I could snap the camera, so that kind of helped out a little bit. So let's get our stuff here, and then I guess we'll be done for this one. Flanker's teeth hurt now. Eat too much. Garbage. Like, you're so needy. You're the neediest garbage disposal I've ever met. So yeah, let's stop here for now, because I counted about six and a half minutes, maybe five, in the first part of this video, and I'm going to slice the second part in there, so next time, more of Clanker's Cavern stuff. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.